Hey right guys, Trophy Reacts here, and today we are watching and reacting to episode 2, uh, two episode 3 of Dawson's Creek Season 1. Last episode was... something, it, it was it was something. Uh, <laughs> just, just, uh, yeah. Yeah, so if you enjoy the episode, make sure to leave a like, as it does help the video and it does help the channel. And Patreon is linked down below. If you do want to join us over on there, we'll be about 10 episodes ahead. Uh, so we would have finished... Well, we would have just done the finale of season one by the time this one's on YouTube. So if you do want to join, like I said, it'll be linked down below. But for now, let's do this. We're watching. Probably a dad's porno. This is the gen moment. This is my future we're watching. Okay. Mm, black and white future. How retro. No, I'm talking about the romantic apotheosis. Look at his psycho eyes. Creating the perfect moment. It has to be planned with the right... Music and lighting and dialogue. Dialogue? You can't. It's not reality, Dawson. Sure you can. <laughs> it's not... I think he actually might have an episode where he does just like shoot up a school or something. Look at him. Magically drop from the sky and sweep us off our feet. I didn't know you had a thing for Brad Pitt. I don't. It's an analogy. Sandra Bullock? Dawson. Both. You used to be bitter and cynical too. You're far more interesting. But now I choose magic. Okay, Dawson. Okay. One day you'll understand, Joey. You'll know what it's like to long for someone to... This hairy ass leg. I just wish he would chill. If he could just rein it in a bit, I think we'd be alright. <laughs> Let's try to keep the story meeting a little more upbeat and politically correct, Nelly. I wonder if Dawson's gonna say anything to pipe up. I mean, it has to be something bigger. We start shooting tonight. I mean, shouldn't the script be locked? Watch. Yes, but we need to solve the ending. He's gonna... He's struggling, he's struggling. Drinking. His girlfriend got knocked up. Kill someone. An unexpected death always works. Guys, guys. Oh, it is. He went about 30 seconds, to be fair. Anybody ever see Rocky or the Karate Kid? I mean, this film needs to be about the underdog, not the golden boy. <laughs> we, the audience, need to know why this game is so important to him. What's he going to prove to himself if he wins it? We need to care about him. He has a point. <laughs> Pathetic. I guess we're killing someone. I'm going to have to insist you shut him up. Uh, the, the jock thought he was onto something. Me Don't tell me you've come to see the tea, you have come to see the tea. you need okay. to see me after yeah. class? And on that farm, he has a... Stop, Pacey. This is serious. <laughs> wow. The charm. I need a slave driver. Somebody with a whip, maybe? Pacey, we can't interact like this. You keep saying that and you do nothing about it. Oh, whatever. I have a teacher's meeting after class. But I'll be working late. Meet me here later. Oh my god. Yeah, I can't wait for this episode already. Does this go on the whole season, this? I'll say end of Ep 3 is where they get caught. Someone sees them through a window. Doesn't confront them, but does see them, this episode. Our serving wench is here. Of course, this completely ruins my romantic plans with Jen this weekend. Oh yeah, go on about it. And the perfect place to seduce the young and beautiful actress playing Penelope. I guess. Good luck. Dog, you are sly. You make it sound so cheap. <laughs> you make it sound so cheap. It's like, bro, can we stop? Oh. Actually, some of those sexy be good. I gotta maybe kind of sort of date this. Sort of shepherd's pie. Mm, who's the lucky farm animal tonight? Uh, what's that? What makes a woman horny? Mm, your polar opposite? And you mean oysters. Right, oysters. A dozen oysters. Joey, pack them up. And you can pack them up now, Joey. Look at us, the guy from Challengers. Hello. <laughs> Anybody home? It's not, but. Do you know him? I've never seen him before. He's probably just some rich kid who just stepped off his mummy and daddy's yacht or something. Oh, a bit of jealousy? Only noticing the opposite sex. Shut up. Uh, excuse me, young man. This woman he's not gonna to allow, He's not going to allow it. Watch. So I did some Forget digging. It, Joey. And... Guys off yachts don't go for waitresses. That do, to be fair, that does actually look like the guy from Challengers. I said it was a joke. No. <laughs> No, 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 no. It's not. I do know him, though. He's from, um, Team Wolf. Yeah, he's a bit old. It's the timeline that's throwing me off. It's like, it can't be the guy from Challengers because this is, like, 90s. Ian Bowen. But then you're supposed to be in my movie, not this homage to headgear. Dawson. Hey. She could be in both films. You made it. Thanks, Dave. It's Dawson. Mate, stop getting jealous. She's already said she'll, like, see you somehow. Like, she agreed to do that. Has Ethan made it to the county fair yet? Uh, yeah. Yeah, he has. Yes, he has. Amazing. Yeah, brilliant. There was no county fair when I read it. 
Oh, okay. That's what that's about. Well, I was captain of the dance team and class right. treasurer. And I studied a lot. Boyfriend? Yes. Yes. Center fielder, why are you asking? Would you have dated me? Oh my god, mate. PC. We're in school. We are not alone. There are people in this building. Why do you care about it? You kissed at the end of a dock. If you were the same age, would you have dated me? Probably not. Well, there you go. That's that. But that was a long time ago. Yeah, that was about what? Maybe 50 years ago? Oh, is it going to be the guy from Team Wolf playing the violin? At the end of a dock for no reason. Yep, it is. So, yeah, called it. <laughs> you know, you were spying on me. It's a public dock. No, I mean, it's okay. My name's Anderson. Anderson Crawford. Congratulations. Oh, that was quick. So, do you come with a name or just an attitude? Just an attitude. And people find this charming. Wait till you meet Dawson, mate. Um, a Pisces, I'm into Harleys, body piercing, and men with tattoos. Hmm. Cool. Are you here with your parents? You guys on a boat? You can lie and um, say you are. Actually, we brought the chauffeur. Oh. Mother hates to sail. She oh, no, the mum's dead, isn't she? Yeah. No, I mean, do you like to sail? Why do you ask? Taking a survey. Because I want you to come sailing with me. Bloody hell, mate. Out into the open ocean where you can murder her, yeah, I'm sure. Dad has a tattoo. If, uh, if you come sailing, you'll find out. Noon. All right. Still less psychotic than Dawson, so we'll take it. I can live with maybe. If at least you tell me your name. Debit Carr. Deb Debit Card. Debit Carson. Debit Carson. What was the name of the town in which they lived? What is Starkfield? Very good. Right. Oh, uh, great. I'm ready. One more. Why do you think Ethan had such a strong sense of duty? Uh, you must cite some examples from your text when constructing your response. Well, that's that. Game over. Yep. Yeah. That's what it yeah. With communal showers. Dawson, suck it up, bro. Go for it, Nelly. Oh, I will. Believe me. As producer, I will tell him <laughs> exactly producer. how you disrupted filming. You were, you were being a nuisance. Shocker. I worked all summer on the script, and I don't appreciate you walking in here and trashing it. Good on her. But this is business. Strictly professional. You need to show a little gratitude. Now you shape up or you're going to be shipped out. out. Understand? He was just talking while they were shooting. Like, what are you doing? Meh. Meh. Everyone be bullies me. So, okay. Seeing beyond the somewhat limited scope of life with her on the farm. Okay. Hmm? Well. Well, well, well. Well, 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 well. And my reward is... This is where they get caught. <laughs> Wait, actually, Mom, it's You got early. me, Pete. Your reward is your education. And leave it at that. Goodbye. Not here, not now. This is my place of employment. It's lit. There's no janitor, no film crew. Well, there is a film crew, but whatever. Where should we do? Uh, I know. My desk. Our first time should be on my desk. What? Strip. Hurry up. We don't have much time. What is this play? What you doing? You're calling my bluff to see how far I'll take it. <laughs> no, 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 I'm deadly serious. Uh, take him off. Okay, well, this is great, isn't it? It isn't the most romantic place on earth, you know. <laughs> well, is this your first time, Pacey? <sighs> Tell me when this is bloody done. I'm gonna sleep. You need to find a girl your own age, not some insane middle aged woman. No. You said that five times and you still keep going. Just to set the record straight. I'm a firm believer that sometimes it's right to do the wrong thing. Yeah. <laughs> sure. What? <laughs> yeah, no, Pacey, mate. Oh, get a quick bit of shut eye while they have their little scenes. You wanna come aboard? Yeah, you. You're actually gonna sail off with this guy? If this was Tree Hill, she'd have been kidnapped by now. Really. No chemistry at the moment. <laughs> He's just been placed in there for Dawson to feel jealous, I'm sure. So what's your boyfriend like? Is this your backwards way of asking if I have one? There's a good way of asking, to be fair. Just trying to save herself for Dawson. You know, I didn't lie about it. The truth can't hurt you. It's a lie, Sophia. Honesty is still the primary quality I'm looking for in a girl. We can do this! Mm. And action! 
Thoughts are going to pop John, up. Don't think of it as a football team. Think of it as a family. <laughs> How so, Tim? Just be able to beat Brister. Now you're talking. That's what I call Minuteman Prime. The camera work is horrendous, though. You run backwards with a handheld and see if you can do it any better. There's actually a technique. If you brace your Did arm... Did you, you say can... something? <laughs> Looking good. It was bad. It was bad. <laughs> Let's just say that as a director, your friend Cliff is a great quarterback. Well, we can't all be prodigies. The helmets of glory. Do you can actually have, like, a film made by the end of the show? Probably. Be an Oscar winner. Hey, if we finish early, you want to help me get that magic hour shot? Absolutely. I'd love the chance to work with a real director. Later. If we ever get out of here. She deserves better. No, you don't. Mm. <laughs> this is Dallas, home of Ross Perot and the Cowboys. <laughs> oh, you're not. Oh, wow. Already. Bloody hell. You two have known each other for genuinely about 20 minutes? He's doing a, doing a press up on her. Why are your arms like that? Now he's floating on her. I'm not Cinderella. Not even close. Yeah, because your mum died, I guess. She's trying to make out like she's this. There's so much going on with me. It's like, I guess. All right, everybody. That's the smallest clap this of all ever. This is the shot. I can feel it. And he's uh, the amount of time Dawson rolls his eyes. It's doing my head in. It's a football team. You have to think of it oh, as a family. Oh come on, mate. Well, how so, Tim? Cut. Sorry. Cut. Hey guys. Just let me do it. Look, Dawson, I've had it whoa, with you. Whoa, whoa. Wait a second. You got an idea? Let, let's hear it. Okay. At least we got a jock who's not. Action! Oh, there John, we go. you can't think of it as a football team. You have to think of it as a family. Let's go get him, brother. Yeah. Touch, <laughs> touch, great, perfect, perfect. Yeah. Uh, yes, 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 yes. Applaud me, Spawn. Uh, sandwiches to go. Cooks while we wait. We're catching magic hour tonight. We weren't, remember? I'll put a rush on it. What has gotten into Joey? I don't know, it's bizarre. Yeah, don't get jealous, Dawson. Sorry, ruined my good mood. I was just trying to have a moment of happiness in an otherwise pathetic existence. You have to pay for that flat ass Coke. One third of a Coke as well, apparently. She put nothing in there. Oh, he found her pretty quick. Well, who's that? Nobody. Nobody's gonna be cute, nobody. Who? Oh, she's trying to make out she doesn't work here. I thought you had to meet your parents. I... Who's Deborah? <laughs> she's never... <laughs> no, she's not. Oh, oh yeah, the honesty thing. Oh, she's not. Well, then, who did I spend the afternoon with? The imposter? I like honesty and by women or whatever he said. <laughs> Wait a minute, what's going on here? Uh, yeah, uh, we're just passing through, though. Uh, Deb and I go to school together. And you are? Anderson. Deb and I went sailing today. Go on, Dawson, don't cry. We've never met, ever. Uh, I'm gonna get a take. The reason you've never met him is he's introduced today, Dawson. Charade is a good seven letter word you can use in that Scrabble game. Okay. Here you go. That's 750. Do they have to pay for the drinks? Miss, would you, uh, would you like anything? No. Thank you. Anytime. Uh, he came in clutch. Are you kidding? That's my favorite. Isn't that yours? Oh, he's no, going to see the teacher. No, my favorite scene is when Streisand meets up with Redford years later in the street and they speak pleasantly. <laughs> and cordially. Mm -hmm. And then she brushes his hair off his forehead the way... Oh, look at this guy. He's the film teacher, isn't he? Oh, stop. I'm going to cry right now. Okay, let's get out of here. I'm going to bloody cry as well. I'll walk you home. You can take the scenic route. The scenic route being the swamp? Hello, tomorrow. <laughs> We're friends, Pacey. I know what you do with your students, so I guess he's in for one heck of a ride. Look, you have got to stop with this before oh it gets out of God. hand. I want you. <laughs> oh my God. So what is this place? The Monster's Secret Haven. I don't know, for real, what is it? It's incredible. My la. She uh, loved Greece. It was her favorite spot, and then she got sick and couldn't travel anymore, so he brought Greece to her. That is so romantic. Yeah, that was pretty, pretty good. This is absolutely... I mean, it helps if you're, like, super rich. Watch me as I create the moment. Go on, Dawson. Let's see your skills in action. I think I'm using this for the closing sequence. What do you think? Well, that's a little schmaltzy, considering it's a horror film. Yeah, but... Yeah, I was going for the, uh... Yeah, but Jen, you're not listening to me! You've just discovered that the monster you killed was really the man you loved. The victim of an experiment gone terribly wrong. I kind of... I want to watch this film. <laughs> I don't 
a camera filter put on. Oscar, boom. Sadness is my special. <laughs> <laughs> Should we do it again? Oh, he's going to try and kiss an hour, isn't he? So, um, he's going to mess it up some hours, isn't he? He's going to, I was going to say something super goofy. You should have just kissed her. Wait, wait, wait a minute. Wait, what are you doing? Um. What? Um. What? Oh, was he filming it? Oh. He was. Was he filming it to put it in his film, or was he filming it in a like? Oh, now we've got our first kiss forever, kind of way. Because I don't know. I was hoping you'd show up. No, you got to stop with the violin. Listen, um, we leave tomorrow. Oh. Let me get you my number. And you are sweetie. Here I go, cause we know he. I'm sure you'll be back, mate. In episode three, four, five, six, maybe five. See, he just went for it. He didn't do all this weird Dawson. Dawson had the environment and the vibes, but then he spoke. That's the issue. And then started, I think, filming it. Not 100% sure what was going on there. You know, I don't find any chemistry between these two, but... At least Joe is doing something different other than just staring at Dawson from afar. <laughs> I'll take that. I've learned their names pretty quickly. Dawson, Joey, Jen, Pacey. Boom. Ah, oh, jeez. We're videotaping a really private... Oh, he, what he did, okay, just, okay. Just let me explain. All right, let me explain. I, I wanted... I wanted the moment to be perfect between us. I want to create something um, special, something worthy of how special I think you are. Dawson, okay, explain just, it, just Dawson. Try too hard. You're overzealous. Yeah. Downfall. <laughs> ah, Jesus. I don't know what else to say. I'm Jack, just misunderstood. My intentions are nothing short of honorable. Okay, mate. Just stop talking like a redditor for two seconds. Coming up with ideas to be smart so that you won't think I'm stupid, but then those ideas ultimately backfire, making me look even more stupid, and oh. I, it's just a vicious... Mate, you are a waffler, aren't you? All I want to do is kiss you, and I'm afraid if I don't kiss you soon, I'm going to explode. <laughs> <sighs> oh, you haven't known for like two weeks. No, I'm scared. Dump him. Why? I mean, they're not together, but... The kiss, the kiss, I mean... You've built this, this kiss up to be such a big deal. What happens if I'm, if I'm a disappointment? Never happen. We keep cutting scenes way too early, I feel. Where were you? Nowhere. Nowhere. <laughs> She's being nice, Bodhi. What does this mean? Uh, Booty? That's his name? Tread lightly. Boulet? That restaurant in New York, it's it's on the east side, isn't it? No, 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 it's uh, it's in Tribeca. And it closed down a couple years ago. Oh, so you lied as well. Up. Why? Ah, oh, jeez. Just gonna let the number go out into the wind. Yep. Oh, that's that then. What? 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 We got hide. You're not meant to be here, are you? Who's been on my property? Oh, it's just two other people. Oh, God, there's like stuff in here. Oh, they're going to kiss now. In the barn, or whatever this is. Uh, somehow he's actually managed to get a kiss. Somehow. Is that the two teachers? It's not actually Pace, is it? <laughs> it was. Oh, my God. That was filmed, though, I think. So I was kind of right about them being caught, but not really, not really, kind of, I was it's like half, half there. Oh god, that was, you know what, was it less painful than the last episode? Probably, I mean we did have the, the mannequin scene, so that, that helped at least. Um, still though, like Dawson wasn't as over the top as he was last episode, but that was... If he somehow was, then that would have been very strange. He was still doing his little eye rolls and moody moments. Um, again, I felt like he was fine in episode one. I don't really know what happened between episode one and two. Like, he still had his, like, nerdy, over-the-top ways, but I guess it wasn't embarrassing, and then he just got embarrassing very quick. Uh, so, 
Still very unsure on Dawson. Pacey, I feel like I'm going to be repeating myself here, but Pacey, I still cannot get a read on as a character. I don't like him. I don't not like him. It's just his story is so... Who's going to be into that story? In this day and age, who's going to be into that story? No one. So it just... I can't get a read on Pacey's character. I wish he was just doing something different. When he's with the group and his friends, like he's fine. But then whenever it comes to him and the teacher, which is 85% of the time... I, I zone out. I, I just cannot. So, yeah, Pacey, again, no opinion on him yet. Joey was a bit better this episode. I like that she just wasn't, you know, gazing upon Dawson the entire time. At least she had no chemistry with this new guy, but at least she was doing something different. That wasn't just staring at Dawson. So uh, she was okay. And Jenna Gad is easily just the most chilled out character of all four of them. For now, that could change. Uh, but for now, she's just the most chill. I'm shocked she's still giving Dawson a chance, but... Here we are. So, kind of how I felt with the last episode. Last episode was obviously definitely more weird than this film. Uh, this film, this episode. But this one just like not a lot happened. I guess Dawson and Jen kissed. Joey met someone new, but they had no chemistry. And then Pacey was just doing the same thing he always does. I don't know why we saw previously on Dawson's Creek and we saw Joey finding out the parents or Dawson's parents were cheating on each other because we didn't even see the parents in the episode. It wasn't even mentioned, I don't think. I could be wrong. Uh, so, yeah, we didn't pick up on that at all. But, yeah, I gave what I gave up one 6.5, up two is a 5 out of 10. This one was slightly better than the last episode. Not as good as episode one, though. I'll go... Six. We'll go like a six out of ten. Better than the last episode, but still nothing amazing going on at the moment. Uh, I just need Pacey to do something more. I need Dawson to chill out. Jen and Joey, I, I don't really have an issue too much with what they're doing at the moment. Uh, so yeah. I have nothing we could introduce. Actually, I was say we could introduce a couple more characters, but I guess we have the jock. He seems like maybe he'll be a character. And then the his is it his girl no it's not his girlfriend but the one who's like directing with them uh she could have some potential as well but we'll see so yeah six out of ten for this one guys thanks for watching leave a like if you enjoyed let me know if you thought the episode down below in the comments and i'll see you next time for episode four until then take care peace